Hello, welcome back to another episode of Halftime TV. Naranda Brown here, your host, and I have some disappointing news. Oh my, um, some disappointing news because as we look ahead to the, the, the Birmingham Diamond League meet, the world's fastest woman over 100 meters, over 200 meters, she will not, and I repeat, she will not be taking part. News broke on Thursday that she had to pull out because of um, a, a, she felt something during during training. I'll quote exactly what she said. Um, out of an abundance of caution after she experienced some discomfort in training. So that was the quote coming from the organizers. They indicated that Elaine Thompson here will not be taking part in the Diamond League come Saturday in, in Birmingham, England. So considering Elaine Thompson here is now out. Let me know who is your favorite to go on and win this 100 meters. We have Sharika Jackson. We have Dina Asher Smith who will be lining up in front of a home crowd. Dina Asher Smith also the 2019 Diamond League winner over 100 meters as well. So we have both these fantastic women lining up. We also have Gabby Thomas out of the United States. Um, so I think it will it will it will still hold some some level of weight when it comes to intrigue and interest from the masses. Um, definitely not the same in the absence of Elaine Thompson here and I know a lot of folks will be disappointed. Myself I was really looking forward to seeing her and I did a live last evening where one one of the, the, the subscribers they lamented that based on the performance that they saw from Elaine Thompson here in Puerto Rico there were signs that she may possibly be 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 be, be injured or be, be facing some level of discomfort so we're still waiting on on the news confirmation or if there's any development coming out of elaine thompson here as camp but as we look forward to the diamond league and you know what's interesting as well we have sherika jackson and we know what sherika jackson is capable of we saw that at the at the olympic games where 100 meters, 200 meters, 4 by one 4 by 4 We know what Sherika Jackson can do. And yet, we have on the male side, the second fastest man ever in Yohan Blake. And there's still more interest in a race where Sherika Jackson, who I wouldn't say she's one of the faces of Jamaican female athletics, probably the third best. Um, yeah, the record states she's the third best sprinter Jamaica has as things stand now. And... Johan Blake is the second fastest man ever and yet we will be more interested in seeing Sherika Jackson and her performance in comparison to Johan Blake. So again, let me know what you guys think going into this race in the absence of Elaine Thompson here. Do you think Sherika Jackson can take it home? Do you think Dina Asher Smith will have a big performance for her home crowd? Remember, she's a national record holder as well for United Kingdom or for England. Um, we, we, we will be paying attention to that one and paying keen attention. We will be um, because of the, 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 the Sturgis is there, Dina Asher Smith, Gab, um, Gab Thomas, and then our very own Sharika Jackson. So again, viewers and subscribers, let me know what you think in the comment section. How are you feeling considering Elaine Thompson here? The world's fastest woman will not be competing um, what do you think? When do you think we'll even see her back on the track? I know she's suffered with injuries in the past and whenever she gets injured these days, I'm a little bit nervous because between you and I, I am, I am very, very excited for that world record this year. And I think Elaine Thompson here will possibly be, be getting that world record through the window. So when stuff like these happen, I, I'm a little bit tense because I, I think it's a hindrance towards her getting to her best form and her um, clearing that world record that was set, what, 34 years ago. So, Elaine Thompson here, I hope you get well soon. I hope it's nothing too serious. And as the title of this one states, cautious, uh, I, I admire the camp for being extra precautionary because we don't want our, our very own. We don't want the face of the female sprinting to, to be sitting out the, the rest of the season because of, of injuries. All right, so Elaine Thompson here, get well soon. Who do you guys have to win the 100 meters for women in Birmingham, United Kingdom? Come Saturday for the Diamond League. Let me know in the comment section. But remember, like, share, subscribe. It is Thursday, the day before Friday. So it's Friday Eve. I want you guys to enjoy what's left of your day and enjoy your weekend should you not see Halftime TV again this week. Again, remember, like, share, subscribe. Leave your thoughts in the comment section. Who wins this one? 
who will secure the top of the podium in the Diamond League in the United Kingdom for women's. Will it be Dina Asher Smith? Will it be Sharika Jackson? Gabby Thomas, she has something to say. Third fastest woman over 100 meters this year, Sturgis. We're curious to hear what you guys have to say. Peace out. Until next time.